it's finally Friday, which means that we got some new Star Stable codes for Star Rider and some free items. At the beginning of the birthday festival, Star Stable said that each Friday they would release some new codes that would give non Star Riders Star Rider, and us Star Riders would get a free outfit set with full tag and clothes. So let's go check out the codes and let's talk about them. So, as always, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you do, make sure to subscribe, it really means a lot. And now, let's get into it. So first of all, let's get into the Star Rider code. This is the Star Rider code. It is called Free Weekend 3 Yi, but I think they actually misspelled it. I think it's you and not Yi because people in the comments are saying it doesn't work and I don't put it as Yi in here. Anyway, they said, we're back with another weekend offer of three free days of Star Rider. Saddle up and celebrate 12 years of Star Disable with us. This code is valid for anyone who does not currently have a Star Rider subscription. Expires after September 24th, which I think is Monday, so which I think is Monday. I'm honestly not sure if this expires like on Tuesday or if you have to like redeem it until Monday, I don't know. But yeah, just make sure to redeem it and sadly it only works for people who are not paying Star Riders. So if you have like a monthly Star Rider, this doesn't extend your Star Rider, which is honestly like I don't really agree with that. But again, people are saying that this code doesn't work because I, again, I just think they misspelled it. A lot of people are saying it doesn't work and then SSO is just like, please try redeeming it again. And um, yeah, I, I don't really know. So again, just try both versions and you'll probably get it. Now for us, Star Riders, we actually get a free set, as I said, and a helicopter is flying by. I'm not actually sure if you can hear it, but let's just hope you can. not But the code is called B-Day Set SR3 and we get some leg wraps, a saddle bag and a saddle pad in this pastel purple color, which honestly looks so good. And then the saddle bag is black. Star Sable said it is time to start matching your birthday outfit with your horse. This is the third package of four and next week you will have the entire outfit. This code is only available for Star Riders and expires on October 4th. This cannot be used by players using a free Star Rider code. Before we go and check out the full outfit or I guess all of the things we got now, I just want to check what other items we're gonna get because I was really wondering if we're going to get some bows or like other accessories but that doesn't seem to be the case because in the picture where SSO put like the silhouettes of some stuff, they just put a bridle and the saddle. So yeah, I don't think we're going to get them. In here they said, celebrate 12 years of SSO with gifts. Stay tuned every Friday for the next four weeks as we release redeem codes. Subscribing Star Riders get festive fashion and non-Star Riders get three days of free Star Rider. That's 12 free days for 12 years of SSO. So anyway, let's check all of the items now i do have a lot of um gifts that i didn't really redeem i mean i redeemed the codes for the gifts but or i guess the items but i don't really like use them because of course but yeah right now we actually have quite a lot of things we have a hat shirt gloves boots pants and then for the horse i guess we have leg wraps saddle pad and saddle bag so i guess the only thing that's missing is the bridle and the saddle i would really like some accessories but it seems like we're not going to get them and honestly okay so let's just take a closer look at the outfit i honestly really like the colors i've said it quite a few times now but i just think this color looks so good and this year's outfit is i feel like the best so far though i do feel like the like the shirt the jacket and the pants don't really match this purple aesthetic i feel like they're all clashing but I guess compared to some other like birthday outfits like, like Ronald the McDonald, I guess it looks pretty good. Honestly, it's my favorite outfit so far, but I just feel like it gives a whole different vibe. I mean, I guess we did get a different sweater and pants that go with this outfit. So, okay, I take that back. 
I really like the harp details. I think they look so cool and the jacket i just love all the little engravings like they look so good the hat everything it just looks so amazing i like it now for the leg wraps they also have the harp which i think is so cool i feel like that's kind of the heart of Jorvik. so i really like that they incorporated it they did the same thing with the saddle pad it's a very adorable outfit and I guess another very big factor in the code releases is where are the circling codes? I hate when I say back in the day because I feel like, I, I don't know, just, I, I think it's kind of cringe and I'm always like, oh my gosh, back in the day, everything was so much better. But back in the day, we truly did get a lot more Star Rider codes and Star Queen codes. Right now, we only get one for Christmas we get a 300 star coin code and i i honestly don't remember if we got a star coin code for star Sybil's birthday last year i don't think we did but i'm honestly not sure but i know that this trend of not getting a star coin code for star Sybil's birthday started on their 10th birthday i believe where instead of a code we got a free horse which i guess holds like higher value it was a Jorvik wild horse which usually costs 975 star coins and their star coin codes are usually like 300 star coins but honestly i just miss the star coin codes i feel like giving people like i don't know two three hundred star coin codes a year is really not much like you honestly can't even buy a horse with that so i don't know why they're hesitating so much i mean i know but it's kind of like the players would be so grateful under each and every comment section on their Instagram posts, especially the ones with the codes, everyone is just asking where are the star coin codes. And honestly, I'm still not sure if we're going to get it. I'm very doubtful, but I did see one comment on Instagram where they kind of alluded to us getting it, but they might have also meant like just other reading codes and not necessarily a star coin one. So I wouldn't really go off of that. Right now, I'm honestly really thinking, I'm not even sure what year it was, but the year when SSO like slowly released, I think it was like 50 Star Queens codes by popping the balloons on their YouTube channel. I just feel like that was so fun. And I briefly mentioned this in a short or a TikTok video that I made a while ago, but I feel like right now, the Star Stable, like social media and just Star Stable, the company as a whole is so disconnected from the community. I feel like back in the day, everyone knew the social media team, like their names, like they're kind of the personalities that they put out. But right now, I, I don't know, it might just be for me, but I mean, they post TikTok sometimes, but they like they never make YouTube videos. They don't make any like longer form content. I don't know. They just don't really connect. And I just feel like this could be a fun little project that they could do to, you know, interact with the community more. I mean, even the codes right now, I feel like those could be like some videos. I don't know. I'm sure there's a lot of things they could do with them, but I guess they're just not about that anymore. They really abandoned their YouTube channel. Like sometimes we don't even get trailers for new horses. I think some new magical horses just don't get trailers anymore. Like the last year's Halloween horses, I think they just are featured in the trailer for the Halloween, which I kind of get. But at the same time, I think trailers were so cool. Like I loved watching them. I loved like the iconic sound of the like star at the end and all of that. And now there's just none of that. So yeah, I just kind of missed that. Are we going to get a Star Queen code? I don't know, but probably not. But yeah, I think honestly, I'll just go check out those videos that I talked about with the balloons on their birthday because I just find them so nostalgic and so fun. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video as always and I'm going to see you in my next one. Bye!
Hi Star Family, Star Stable Archie here with some very special fourth birthday greetings from Star Stable HQ. We've got four clear transparent balloons filled with glitter and some rolled up pieces of paper. On those rolled up pieces of paper are redeem codes. Mm -hmm. And here comes our little uh, Star Stable helper from the left here. Magic wand attached to red and she's popped the balloon. Oh, there's glitter everywhere. Our cleaner is going to hate us. But there she goes, she's popped the balloon, and in the balloon is this redeem code. It's Silverglade, and it's going to be worth 100 star coins as part of our birthday present to you. Because, you know, it's our birthday, but we're giving you presents. Go figure. Uh, yeah, join us tomorrow for more redeem code fun from Star Stable. Hi Star Family, Star Stable Archie here with more birthday greetings from Star Stable HQ. Here's Game Master Vendela trying to make our special birthday number four balloon stay the right way around, which is harder than it looks. And here comes our super fan Esmeralda Kingly. She's been helping us make our tutorial videos here on Star Stable's YouTube channel and she's popping today's birthday balloon because we invited her in because she's a legend. Golden Hills is today's redeem code and it's worth 100 star coins just like yesterday's and just like tomorrow's will be. Will it add up to 400 star Star coins for our fourth birthday. Who knows? <laughs> Join us tomorrow for more birthday fun with Star Stable. Thanks for watching. Hi Star Family, Star Stable Archie here with more fourth birthday greetings from Star Stable HQ. Uh, we've got Game Master Vendela. She's back and she's going to pop a balloon. There she goes. She's done it. She's a success in life. Pop in the balloon there to reveal today's 100 star coin code, which is Dino Valley. What could this be? Dino Dino Valley! Yay! 100 star coins for you today for using the code Dino Valley. All part of our fourth birthday celebrations here at Star Stable. See you tomorrow. Hi Star Family, Star Stable Archie here with the last of our fourth birthday redeem code reveal videos, complete with glitter. Yay! Here comes Game Master Eleanor from our German server to pop today's balloon. There she goes, doing it in the most glamorous way of all four videos. And um, yeah, so today's code, here it is, it's Fort Maria. Fort Maria. Where's Fort Maria in Jorvik? I haven't seen it before. Oh yeah, it's in the South Harvest Counties. I can exclusively reveal right now in this video that the new area coming to Jorvik this autumn is the South Harvest Counties. And one of the villages in the South Harvest Counties is Fort Maria. And here it is with a beautiful night sky and it's, oh, ah, I can't even speak. It's so beautiful. So, congratulations. You've now got 400 star coins from us for our fourth birthday here at Star Stable. And you now know that the South Harvest Counties is coming this autumn. If you've had fun this last four days with the birthday code reveal video thingies that have been so much fun to make, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe for more cool fun content from Star Stable. Happy birthday to us! Yay! Bye!